Today we have these two young men that uh, we've been studying the Bible with, uh, but that was after their decision saying, I want to accept Christ as my Savior. And I love it. I love it. Carter Banks, uh, everybody's known Carter all his life, if you've been here in the congregation uh, any time. Uh, Jared uh, Aguirre, uh, and I cannot pronounce it the way it, the other way, but uh, listen, guys, I am so proud of these young men. Uh, I did not study with them together. I studied independent of them, and both of these young guys are uh, sharp. They're intelligent. They're quality guys, uh, but they need a Savior. They need Jesus. And so I'm going to ask them both, and they can say it at the same time, but do you guys believe in Jesus? Yes. I believe in Jesus. Yes. Repeat after me. I believe, I believe that Jesus is the Christ, that Jesus is the, Christ the, Son of the, living God, the Son of the living God, and my Savior. And my Savior. Amen. Amen. Praise God. I'm going to ask, uh, as I pray out loud to God, I've already instructed them that they need to uh, pray and ask God to forgive them. Uh, ask God, do for me, God, what you promised in your word to do when in faith I'm baptized into Christ. And so let's pray. Heavenly Father, we humbly bow before you in thanksgiving that after 2,000 years, people are still confessing the name of Jesus and they are still being baptized into him. I pray, dear God, for Jared. I ask blessings on him to serve Christ with all his heart, all his days. I pray for Carter that he would serve Jesus with all his heart, all his days. And dear God, I ask uh, that whenever these young men go through tough times, that they'll come to their minister, they'll come to their elder, they'll go to a, a Christian friend, and they'll, they'll talk and they'll share and they'll pray together and they'll live out this Christian life and, and uh, that your blessings will pour upon them from heaven. And Lord, we thank you for the forgiveness of sin. We thank you for the blood of Jesus off of Calvary's tree. We thank you, dear God, that while Jesus was buried, he raised from the dead on the third day and that gave us our hope that we too will raise at the end of time. We thank you for the promise that Jesus Christ is coming again to receive his bride, to receive his church, his kingdom. And we long for that. I ask blessings on these two men right now. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Joe Gray, if you'll read some scriptures for us. Or don't you know that all who were baptized into Jesus Christ were baptized into his death? We were therefore buried with him through baptism into death in order that just as Christ was raised from the dead through the glory of the Father, we too may live a new life. For if we have been united with him in a death like, the, like his, we will certainly also be united with him in a resurrection like his. For we know that our old self was crucified with him so that the body ruled by sin might be done away with and that we should no longer be slaves to sin because anyone who has died has been set free from sin. Now if we died with Christ, we believe that we also live with him. For we know that Christ was raised from the dead. He cannot die again. Death no longer has mastery over him. The death he died, he died to sin once and for all. But the life he lives, he lives to God. In the same way, count yourselves dead to sin, but alive to God in Jesus Christ. So in Christ Jesus you are all children of God through faith. For all of you who were baptized into Christ have clothed yourself with Christ. What a great day it is today to celebrate with these two young men and their decision for Christ. So in a few moments here, the curtain's going to open up and we're going to get to rejoice with them. We're not sure how the Lamb's Book of Life records our days 
whether it uh, records our earthly birthday, as in Nancy Shoemaker's birthday today being today. Happy birthday, Nancy. Happy birthday. If it records our, daily birth, or our earthly birthday, if it records our heavenly birthday where we decide to be immersed with Christ. But today, these two young men, they're being added to that Lamb's Book of Life. So praise God for their, uh, their dedication and their willingness to follow Christ Jesus.
Jared Tyler Aguar. Upon your confession that you believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of the living God, I now baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit for the forgiveness of your sins and the free gift of the Holy Spirit. Amen. <laughs> Praise God. I love it. Keep standing right there. I don't know if you noticed it, but he just shook like a dog and got my face wet. <laughs> Did you see that? It's all here. <laughs> okay. All right. Carter Hayden Banks, upon your confession that you believe that Jesus is the Christ, the Son of the living God, I now baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit for the remission of your sins and the gift of the Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless you both. We're going to sing this song. Uh, let's have prayer. Lord God, I celebrate faith. And I thank you for these two young men and their faith in the power of Jesus. And I celebrate that. I know that you walk with us, Lord, and you'll walk with them. But I also pray, dear God, that they will not be discouraged by anything that they might see someone else do or say. But they will live triumphant and strong and faithful all their lives for Jesus. In his name we pray. Amen. with us. Please come back by the sound booth so we've got a gift for you and please take time to stick around so you can congratulate the two uh, young men. It's good to see you brother. Love you brother. Me too. Good to see you.